Well, welcome, and uh, thank everyone for. Uh, I want to thank everyone for coming out today, especially on uh, such a cold and windy day. But uh, we're here to uh, break on on a very important and exciting construction project here for the district. Um, and so we're just going to have a few comments first, and then we'll get to some groundbreaking in a minute. But um, first, I just want to make a couple comments. Um, as I look back at the history of, of Parkview, we've had a number of different construction projects. And what we found uh, that really was common with all the projects were two things. One, we had a very specific need. And we were also very financially stable in order to afford the construction projects. So for example, starting with um, the West Wing is a very good example of um, where we had a very clear need. And that situation we have today. Um, I took a look at some of our attendance and uh, enrollment numbers. And uh, I think it was back in 2009, 2010, we had just around 800 students. And we find ourselves today with over 850 students. So we've seen a, a steady increase in enrollment. Uh, and that brings us to the construction project that we're about to break ground on today. And from a financial standpoint, um, the district, the administration, and the board is very proud to be in a very good financial position to be able to afford this, uh, this construction project. Um, uh, of, of particular note, uh, taxes will not go up, and we're paying for this uh, construction project through a combination of existing funds that is out of our operating budget. So the taxes will not go up as a result of this construction project, which everyone's very proud of. Um, before we get started, I do want to make a, just say a few thank yous to, to, uh, to some very important people who are part of this construction project. First, I'd like to thank our superintendent, Dr. Collins, for spearheading this, uh, this initiative. Thank you. The administration team, uh, Dr. Sukenik and Mr. Pump, thank you as well as uh, a lot of support from our, uh, from our staff, uh, including Mrs. Frake and Mrs. Reich, thank you very much, and the facilities uh, staff uh, who have helped uh, make sure that we're all coordinated during this construction phase and the operations of the school continue to uh, flow, uh, flow very well. Uh, I wanna thank the facilities committee, uh, Wayne Yukana and Paul McGivern for their uh, efforts in uh, walking the board through this process of construction. And I'd like to thank the Finance Committee of uh, Paul McGivern and Annette Greiner for helping us make sure that we can uh, creatively finance and uh, maintain the financial stability that we've enjoyed over the past few years. I'd like to thank uh, Alan Ambrose from SDR Partners, who was our uh, architect on the project. And we'd like to thank uh, Joe Papa Nicholas uh, and his associates from Nicholas and Associates. So thank you very much. So what we're going to do now is we're going to uh, kick this off, get to groundbreaking, and we have some students that are going to help us with that. Uh, we're going to take a few photos, and then Dr. Collins will finish up and have a few uh, parting comments. So let's get to groundbreaking. I just want to thank everybody for coming. I think it's important for us to document these kinds of things as we move forward as an organization and as a district. And I'm excited about the opportunities that this new addition is going to create for our students. 
and just some of the educational possibilities that it's going to help us uh, delve into as we move forward as an organization. I also want to thank our community for being patient with us through this process. We'll, we'll be excited to see how the space evolves over the next several months, and we look forward to a dedication ceremony in the fall uh, once the space is completed and finished and ready to go. So thank you for coming, and have a wonderful weekend.